CAD. Sometimes if you use CAD, you really don't have to put any yellow in it because there's a whole lot of yellow in CAD. Yellow needs CAD. Yes, yellow. CAD red light, excuse me. Let's see what we No, that's too. I'm making the shadow <laughs> color. Too cool? Let's make it, let's, let's make it opaque, opaque, did I just say that? Let's make it opaque. to do this with just color actually or you can oh, I'm sorry. like on the color chart you can do it with white I'm gonna, I'm gonna see if we can do it with Let's see if we can find this very same thing without using white, possibly. So you're going to use quite a bit of yellow, because <coughs> it's opaque, it's light.
what's wrong with this? Too bright. Meaning too cool. Yes. Need teeny bit warm. Closer to temperature. Is everybody with me? Mm -hmm. Need somebody said too light. Said that. <laughs> <laughs> I said it. So let's lighten it all up. <laughs> Pretty close. Mm -hmm. Temperature right. Value right. A little dark. So, once you do this, meaning, what did he do, or we do next, was cast a shadow across not only the paper, but across this, and we just made it darker, meaning, <coughs> we see the same procedure. Teeny bit dark, but I'm almost happy. Is this making sense with what we're going to try to do? Mm -hmm. Guys, all you got to do is paint a color out there, and then theory-wise, theory-wise, in fact, let's do one. doesn't matter. Let's make a red, which means... Reasonably close. And let's say he's half supposed to be my red. Give it somewhat opaque. Now what do I do? Cast the shadow. There. I'm looking, I'm looking for that. Who wants to be my shadow caster? Somebody. You could. You are. Thank you. You are good at that. I'm going to put 
a blue in it. In other words, I, I'm a painter. I'm, I don't mix up green and actually stick. I don't do that. I grab a little blue. Let's test it. Sit. Hold it on. No. To give you a simple guess. <coughs> Hold it right there. See what I mean? <coughs> now that's the color I'm looking for. Right? Who's making this noise? <laughs> I'm going to quit on my head. Y'all with me? Now, if you move this on over, now we're getting pretty dark and we're going pretty blue. I can't even see that. So, let's get darker, bluer. May have to put a touch of yellow. Anybody see me put black in there? It's a little blue. Go back. Pull the red back. Pull the red back. Let's test it. Oh, ha, ha, ha. Need some yellow. guys will like uh, the sunshine better than this artificial stuff. This will look a little different when it dries. It will dry darker than it is. That's the nature of the beast. So, begin to follow me here. We can do green just as easily as we do. In fact, we can do any of them. Here. Hell, we all did 111 of the orange and blue routine. Actually, that's what you were doing. So. Let's say we were doing it, and I'll just use the paint I've got left here. Somebody didn't clean my palette the last time. Somebody used it. So. <laughs> <laughs> that would be Jacqueline. Okay. Say that's green. That's a 
warm green because I'm using a warm yellow. And if you're consistent, I don't care what color you start with, you follow what I'm talking about because that's going to dictate the color. <laughs> oh, yeah, there she goes. Now, let's take a little of this red I mixed up since I, that's why I was confused. Now, let's start cutting that just a little more. May take a little more lizard. it's cooling. Let's see what that is. Test, test, testing. Warm. Warm. So not only do you add alizarin, it's getting a little darker, so you add a little more blue. Does everybody understand the concept? That's why you can't just mix up the opposite color and expect to put the right amount in there and this is going to work. That it doesn't work that way. That's the theory you're putting opposite color, but when it's getting darker, opposite color ain't going to get it until you put more blue because blue is your darkening agent. Oops, wrong pile of paint. I think it's like I can't find anything on this palette. More blue. Okay. Somebody open it. You got my blue? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Still waiting for me to do. <laughs> way to go, way to go, baby. Yeah, I'll get it. Okay, let's try that. Okay, let's go to that. I see that? I like more blue. Back this off so they can see it. I'm getting a glare on it. I can't even see what I'm... Does that look close to anybody that doesn't have a glare? Jackie says yes, so I'll quit. Okay, catch shadow across the next one. And how do we get that dark? Well, obviously, you're going to take more blue. Let's test it. <laughs> Got pretty close pretty quick. Over the break? I did. What'd you do? Camping. M camping? Mm -hmm. It rained. In the mountains? No. <laughs> in the backyard? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I used to camp in the backyard when I was about 14. And sneak out. You get Bob's big brother's Volkswagen. Anybody want to comment on that? Bring out the word to. To what? We had a lecture today on to. T-O-O. -O. Everything's to something. Anybody want to comment? I'm, I'm, I can't see today for some reason. Well, that really dries. It's it's pretty difficult to tell. Oh, 
dry, so it keeps warmer. Then I'll put a real red in it. That class will know what we're doing. No. Warm it up. dries and gets the glare off of it. We'll see how close we go. In the meantime, I blow it up. Thank you. This one now that it's dry, let's check it again and see. Reasonably close, gentlemen. Reasonably is that reasonably close? <laughs> close. Oh yeah, I'm happy. Y'all happy? You know how to do this? I, I need yours to look more like this. Mine doesn't fit in boxes and stuff. <laughs> Guys, if you don't want to have to, I mean, all you got to do is just trace a ruler. Give me, give me, and, and, and what size are these? It doesn't matter. Y'all follow what I'm talking about. I just want you to go through casting that shadow. If you will find a little object that is sort of a neutral, this one's white, which affects the, you know what I mean, affects the color here. But if you'll find a uh, sort of a little object that you can just set on your on your pad, and if you will use the sun, if the sun ever comes out, and you will have better luck. Sit to where you're positioned your pad. You see what I mean? Notice this one. If this, if you're sitting here like this, you say, "Well, I can't. This, this is not working." Well, all you got to do is turn your pad around till it it cuts across your uh, paint the way you want it to. Sun is better. I and I apologize for the sun not being here today. However, anybody wants to use this little culprit, you go right ahead. Uh, you can use a little clamp light, but your the, the shadows are going to be way less dramatic. <coughs> not the same. So, sunshine is your it's great. Don't know. We're going to Tulsa on Thursday, so. <coughs>